Hey, what's up guys? I just want to make a little quick video here. I had a little bit of free time, so I thought I'd come out and ride my, my side by side a little bit. Uh, last few days, it's uh, been kind of stormy around here in Kentucky. There's been thunderstorms rolling in one right after the other. Um, it was sunnier this morning. The sun was out, not a cloud in the sky. Then suddenly it just all rolled in and it looks like it's going to rain again. Skies are turning dark. The wind's uh, starting to pick up. But uh, I was riding along here on some of these trails here, and I just want to uh, to show you guys something that I ran into. And I mean, this is a this is a pretty common thing in these rural areas. I'm sure some of you guys that uh, that watch my channel probably live out in some of these rural middle of nowhere areas like I do, and you have problems like this. With it being springtime, people do a lot of uh, uh, what they call spring cleanup on their properties. I know I do it too. There's, they do a lot of brush clearing and things like that, you know, and uh, a lot of people, they just pile their brush up and they burn it. Uh, I know that's what I do, uh, but uh, some people don't do that around here. Uh, like I said, this is a really rural area. I mean, it's, it's way out in the middle of nowhere. There's not many houses around, so there's not a lot of, a lot of eyes on people doing uh, activities like this. But what I wanted to show you guys is this right here. Yeah, this is uh, this is when people are clearing their properties and stuff, and they you know they don't want to burn it. They want to get rid of the stuff really fast. What they do is they just find a nice quiet holler, and uh, they load their truck down, trailer, whatever, and uh, they dump their stuff because they. And we literally we literally have a uh, a, a landfill here nearby. I mean, yeah, it costs a little bit of money to dump your stuff there, but. You know, these people, they they take it up on their sales to go and dump their trash and brush and stuff like that out on, on other people's properties. And you can see here's a big pile of brush. This hasn't been here too long. Uh, um, just all kinds of stuff. Uh, another pile of tires up there. Not quite sure what that is over here. Uh, looks like uh, plastic water piping. Um, looks like plastic, uh, some kind of plastic containers of some kind, almost like a fuel tank, plastic fuel tank, maybe old logs, just all kinds of brush, all kinds of trash. Uh, this seems to be the dumping spot. You can see here, there's quite a bit here. Uh, the problem with it really is well for one thing it's an eyesore anyone that wants to to ride this holler i mean this this holler here a lot of people ride in here and for the most part the people that use this holler there's a lot of side roads a lot of old logging roads it's an old mining road is what it is and it's back that way there's just miles and miles of nothing uh you can ride for days and never be on the same road twice i mean it's it's, it's fantastic but then you got these uh, these little nitwits that want to uh, dump their garbage and brush. And I mean, this is not the only spot either. Uh, if you go this way, there's several other spots. Not quite as bad as this one, but there's several others where they dump. They try to hide it. Uh, some people will like dump it over in the creek bed. Like there's a little creek bed that runs this way. And they'll back their vehicles back up to the creek and they'll throw stuff in the creek well the problem with that is i live that way at the mouth of the holler and when it floods when we have these washouts sometimes we have these big mountain washouts and literally the water will come right down this road here and when it does it gathers up all of this trash and brush washes it into the creek beds and then the creek beds carry it out to my property and then I'm stuck with the cleanup, you know. I have trash in my yard. My fence lines have trash caught up in it. You know, it's just a, it's a really big problem. It's, it's happened several times over the years. Yeah, I guess some of you guys, if you, if you got the same problem in your area or on your property or somewhere where you ride where there's illegal dumping, um, 
hey leave me a comment i would like to know what you've seen or what you've done about it i mean i have uh i have uh called the cops you know i have uh went to the uh to the to the local courthouse and and talked to them about you know getting some of this cleaned up or maybe getting some no dumping signs put up or something like that you know but there's there's really nothing that they do about this people get away with it all the time it's been going on for years and years i've called a few guys you know dumping like this and i'll you know i will set them straight and uh and uh make them leave and to not come back and do that anymore but uh kind of getting fed up with this guys i mean this is a really bad problem seems like it's just getting worse and worse every year but yeah that's my little rant i mean this this has been going on for a long time and I, there's just no way of stopping it these rural areas people just dump garbage everywhere in the summertime you don't see as much of it because all the the greenery comes out and hides a lot of it but now in the winter time when all the leaves are gone off the trees i mean you really see the garbage really bad it's all up and down the ditch lines all up and down the creek beds it, it's it's everywhere so anyways guys that, that's that's my little vent for the day yeah i was a little i was a little upset over this but uh please leave me a comment if you run into a uh, trap like this on your property or you've seen stuff like this go on and uh, let me know i mean i like to hear about things like that I like to hear what uh, you guys, what your uh, uh, situations are and what you did about it. So, and as always, please uh, like this video uh, and subscribe to this video. I'm slowly creeping up there. I'm over 800 subscribers now and trying to get to that 1,000 mark. So please hit that subscribe button. It helps me out a lot. Until the next video, see you guys later. Well, guys, right after I ended the video, I saw this laying beside the road. How I missed it before, I don't know, but I figured you guys would get a kick out of this. Someone threw this out. You want me to open the pages up? I better not. I don't think YouTube would approve of that. We'll just leave it there. <laughs> Wow. All right, guys. See you next video.